guys we're here in tampa we finally made it down here we are doing the uh, new rides on the 2024 doing some harley davidson training and uh, the weather down here is just gorgeous it was cold when i left home so i'm looking forward to what today so it feels good to be back on the road glide versus the street glide definitely a fan Handling feels more natural for me and what I'm used to. So definitely love the handling of the road glide over the street glide. And I won't make any qualms about that at all. So I'm used to riding a road glide. I mean, it's cool to get out and ride and be in Florida. Don't get me wrong. We'll definitely not complain. Just kind of like I'm riding. So same road we had the wind before with the street glide and the road glide. I honestly don't even know that the wind is there every now and then, like right now. Feel a little breeze going through my jacket. Even with a stock windshield, none of it is hitting my head at all. If I didn't hear it and know that it was so noisy, I wouldn't think that the wind was even blowing. Just because of the contrast between the street glide and the road glide is so significant. Kind of digging the orange. I've never uh, been a big orange fan, but kind of digging the orange. Looks pretty in this Florida sunshine. It's a very Florida bike. So being this is our first comparison ride, I made sure I got on a 23 road glide first. So definitely feel the major comparison to the 24. I mean, the road glide just handles so well. But listening to the guys riding the 24s and then riding the 23, you definitely can tell a difference in the motor sound and changing gears and the clunkiness. On the 24s, neutral is super easy to find. I mean, it's still got some get up and go. That's for sure. So it is nice to have a big motor where you don't really need to downshift to to roll on that's one thing i will credit the m8 for even over my personal bike i, I didn't need to downshift at all to gain more power i just rolled on the throttle and uh, it was plenty enough there's our flag again swirling around so you can see visually what the wind is doing but really i just i haven't felt much at all even at the quasi highway speeds we we're allowed to travel with the traffic being in the way so fun man the pickup's still good um i think the road glide just feels a little peppier to me i don't know maybe it's preference maybe i'm biased in my opinion i think the road glide feels a little peppier overall even going from 23 street glide to 23 road glide be interesting to do a really good ride on the 24 road glide and see the perspective change we just went over some pretty big holes in the road uh, normally where your tire you know might have some issues and with the road glide I just feel really more comfortable you that than the street glide <laughs> uh, following the group and everybody missed the turn I think I'm gonna ride this here black on black one I will say the weight of taking these 24s off the side stand is a lot easier than the 23s and finding neutral in these is just easy first neutral first neutral super simplistic yeah right out of the gate just i mean even taking off the throttle response is so different man i mean it's just unreal and the weight just seems so almost non-existent
these things are just so nice and nimble the handlebar placement is is awesome harley did such a great job with the handlebar placement on these 24s yeah that was just road mode the power is just sick <laughs> this is so fun you like that one so it looks like HB's in love with the street glide. Well, yeah, that's, that's my bike. You're nice and comfortable? Most comfortable. I feel I'm, I'm riding a sport. Though. Looks like it fits you good. The black on black looks good. Yeah, I'm kind of disappointed they didn't have the CVOST. I guess uh, we're not cool enough to be able to ride those, but. This is still fun, for sure. So like I said, the bar placement on this is just like perfect. The bars are taller. They're not too tall. I mean, for me being 5'6", I have some bend in my elbow. I mean, they just feel so comfortable. Even though I recently switched to T-bars on my bike and I love the T-bars, especially for stock bars, these are pretty good, gotta say. Probably the best stock handlebars on a bike uh, I have ever ridden. Okay, so the wind on the 24 is definitely hitting different on the road glide, just like it did on the street glide. And I don't know, maybe it's just because I'm used to the 23 and, you know, that, that comfort that I have on the bike, but the wind definitely feels more present than it did on the 23 and definitely not as bad as the 23 street glide or the 24 street glide all right we put her in sport mode to make this turn we've had a lot of traffic here and then we got to get on the highway and deal with that crap so and yes i just put in sport mode and rolled the throttle and it did pull me back just a little bit so Lots of fun. So we pulled from first up to fourth, got up into the 65 plus range, and I wasn't even like really pulling on that throttle at all just having a little fun but the response was there I could see if I own one of these and I had it in sport mode I would probably be in trouble uh, on a, a regular basis because it is just so fun and the ironic thing is if you actually knew me I am not the uh, speed demon, like, you know, type mentality when I ride that is just really not me, but damn, it's fun. So being out on the highway, I mean, the wind feels okay. Um, definitely feel the wind more than on the 23 that's something I really wanted to pay attention to after feeling that earlier so I will definitely say as an end result the 23s edge out the 24s in wind protection and aerodynamics in my opinion and I've really been trying to be in tune to this suspension on this bike and kind of see how things feel and I mean you still feel the bumps on the road but it's not feeling like your ass is on the seat pan or bouncing off the backbone of the, the frame for sure the suspension is really good handling in turns has been really good even uh, you know getting on some of these 
curves and, and kind of pushing her in the corner a little bit. Uh, the suspension has performed very well. Of course, our flag again with the wind. Yeah, just there's no falter with this at all even with the wind I mean I feel the wind on me but the bike has stayed super true the whole time it's not like the wind is really whipping the bike around I can just feel it on me so as far as the handling man this thing is just I am impressed and I'm not being biased because I work in the Harley industry this is strictly a real life review and I wanted to feel the difference that way I can share it with you guys and let me just tell you they've done an outstanding job on the 24s so as far as an overall review definitely prefer the road glide over the street glide the 24 definitely wins in like throttle response handling suspension um, just overall just fun to ride I mean the ergonomics of this bike are great from the handlebars to the foot pegs the seat is super comfortable for a stock seat um, it's nice and grippy it's holding my butt like a big glove um, like I said the 23 is win on aerodynamics hands down but most important question people probably want to know is would I buy a 24 uh, the answer to that is hell yes I would buy a 24 Roglad probably black on black I don't know white on black is pretty awesome colors are really nice I like whiskey fire and shark skin but I would probably go black on black which is the bike that I'm on it just looks beautiful but damn is this thing fun Just in that little rip right there just man a blast so yes I would buy a 24 model for sure buy the road glide um, I don't know probably got to ride the street glide some more do some more experimenting wish we had longer time to ride and uh, experiment with them but 24 road glide hands down yes 100% So that will do it for the ride that will do it for this video i appreciate you coming along to my trip to tampa to do this if you enjoyed the content of the channel please like share and subscribe leave a comment down below let me know what you think if you've got a chance to ride a 24 model yet or not until next time guys have fun enjoy your life and live it have a great time and thank those that allow us to be out riding free until next time, we'll catch you later.